yellow. The color of this shirt, as well as two of those I have laying around my room that I can see right now. The color of the spine of this book. The color of Dollar General grocery bags. And the color of some of the flowers and roses that I saw on my most recent trip to Bulgaria. When I think of the color yellow right now, I think of the flowers that I saw in Bulgaria. And I think of the time that I spent in Bulgaria for two weeks with an amazing group of people and all the experiences that we shared together. We got to sing in an opera house, we got to sing in an ancient Roman amphitheater, we got to sing for some of our tour guides just randomly on the spot. We sang at some of the restaurants that we ate at. We met some children's choirs and we got to sing with them. We met an adult choir and we got to sing with them as well. I absolutely love performing and I love that I got the chance to explore a different culture and learn about that culture while in that country and I also got to perform songs from that culture. Our chamber choir sings many, many Bulgarian pieces, but there's something different about performing them in the country that they originate from. So performing these traditional Bulgarian pieces, these folk Bulgarian songs, being able to perform those in Bulgaria in front of Bulgarian people, it's just something that words cannot describe. Looking out into the audience and seeing people starting to sing along or mouth the words or dance to some of the folk songs that we're singing, it's just this amazing feeling. and. I am so grateful that I had the opportunity to go on that trip. We visited four or five, six different cities, even if they were just for part of the day. We got to have so many experiences and that was honestly a once in a lifetime trip. So when I currently think of the color yellow, yes, I may be wearing a yellow shirt. I may have a yellow cross country shirt from my freshman year of high school. I have a yellow orchestra shirt from junior, senior year of high school. Yellow is the side of the Rubik's Cube that I most often solve last. But when I think of the color yellow right now, I think of those flowers and all the memories that I had on that amazing trip.